January 18, 1991 The Sola writes, Message for my birthday. The Lord speaks, Peace be with you. My divine heart shall encourage you to proceed without fear, and the Father is generous. Have confidence in me. Trust me, little child. I shall fill you with consolation. The footnote reads, For the past days I neither felt God near me nor saw him. I felt as though he deserted me, and I was melancholic. I have tested you. Allow me to assess you now and then. Vasula, even when everything may appear to you as lost, do not get discouraged. I shall smooth your way, but at the same time I shall have you exposed as a sign of rejection. The rejection for unity. Sincerity is missing among them, so how can they make up the differences between them? Vasula says, But Lord, do you mean that they shall reject your messages in the end? The Lord replies, No, my messages shall follow their course without you, but you shall be tossed around. I shall permit your persecutors' defiled hands to strike you and mistreat you openly. I shall allow them to contradict you, and like crows ravaging the crop, they will attack you. You will appear in their eyes as the loser, because the wounds they will inflict on you will be impressive. These wounds, my child, shall be given to you from within my house, and by my own. They will be given to you from Cain's clan. I will allow them to strike an innocent child, but their gladness shall turn into mourning. Yes, you will appear as the loser, my Vasula. But have I not appeared as the loser too? I appeared to have failed my mission. I appeared, in the world's eyes, as the greatest loser ever. You are a sign given to them to arise questions that will be controversial. I do not mean to discourage you, Vasula, even when some of them try to stop my messages from spreading any further among the people. Be firm, my Vasula. Be firm as a rock. Vasula says, Lord, if they break me, as you seem to make me understand, wound my soul near to death, how would I be able to be firm and standing? The Lord answers, Lacerated you shall be, but I, the Lord, shall be standing by your side, and your strength shall be my strength. Come, fear not, bear witness for me.